uh, there is always some slight adjustment when I put it on. So usually in articulation there's something, but it's something that takes less than a minute to adjust. So that's the revolution. Sitting a crown is, is a smiling job instead of oh. Yeah. And the remake percentage is also very low or is it non-existent? Mm -hmm. uh, in the year that I've had this system, I've had zero remakes. Oh, mm -hmm. it's incredible. So if you look at this as a case that's just being ready to be delivered, uh, again, all the things that are traditionally variables with crown fit, you have, uh, there's no micro-movements of the dies, no micro-movements of the pins. Uh, the margin is picked up from the scan and milled with an industrial mill. Uh, when the die is actually removed, uh, you can see that the margin is, is, clearly, is clearly there uh, at the exact point of where we control the soft tissue. So when the crown is, is actually seated, uh, the contacts are, are, are basically made to the exact point of what the doctor is going to quality control them in the mouth, which is dental floss. Uh, again, no micro-movements. The material is urethane, so there's no abrasion of the dye stone. Uh, no micro-movements of the pins, and the margin is picked up from the mouth. Then the occlusion, remember, is exactly where the patient's biting down in tight central occlusion. So again, eliminating the variables of margin, contacts, and occlusion. And this, uh, you know, what's nice about that is there's nothing more frustrating when you're a dentist and the laboratory has done a nice job of building in all the anatomy and the restoration, and then you have to grind it all off because there may be a variable in the occlusion. So now uh, it's able to preserve all the artwork and anatomy that the lab has done and simply drops into position in the mouth.